All right, guys, so I wanted to talk about a little bit of a topic that might not be as clear as day for certain people, which is, you know, fine because it's a little complicated. The question is, if you're an Oakland fan, East Bay, whatever, why are you still a Raiders fan? And that's not a question I'm asking. It's a rhetorical question. Why are why should you still like the Raiders? Because I've had people, Twitter, you know, every social media come at me and say, oh, you know, I had one guy even say, you know, you hate Oakland if you're still a Raiders fan, which doesn't make any sense at all. I've had people say, why would you support a team that betrayed you? Which is a valid question, but it's not really a valid you know, I, you can't really get a, a genuine answer out of me as to why, because yeah, they did abandon, but here's why. So a long time ago when not that long ago, but you know, but in the last couple months, pretty much when the A's have been talking about relocation, I have kind of flirted with the idea that if the A's were to move, um, you know, I would switch to just San Francisco, which it's not looking like they're going to move now. So that's, I'm happy. I don't want to do that, but People come at me now and say, if you're willing to switch because of the A's, why are you not willing to switch because of the Raiders? And I'm just going to state a couple points. And you might not agree with them, but you have to remember, sports fandom is subjective. So, you know, just like most things are. So here's why. If the A's were to move, Oakland is no longer a sports city. Oakland has zero sports teams, which makes it a little interesting because in a bad way, but... It makes it interesting because if Oakland's no longer a sports city, there's no, there's no, you know, interweaving going on, if you will, with San Francisco. Because the way it was when the Raiders were in Oakland was, in, at least in my eyes, Oakland fans were kind of rivals with San Francisco fans. Like you had your A's Raider fans like me with that kind of, you know, looked different. They, they, you know, we didn't like the Niner Giants fans. That's how it was. And then the Raiders moved. So then a portion of these Raider fans, not many of them, but switched to Niners. And so Oakland, but the, there were remaining ones like me that still considered them Oakland, right? So Oakland was still a sports city. So I associated the A's with the Raiders. I associated them because they, the Raiders are player for 50 years and I'm not just going to, you know, pretend they never played here. So then, you know, the A's stuff, you know, caught steam and it did look like they might move a couple months ago. Um, and then I thought to myself, well, if Oakland's no longer a sports city, I have no civil obligation to like the A's or Raiders anymore because they're no longer in Oakland. With the Raiders, I do have an obligation because I still cherish the team that, you know, I can buy Oakland merch for. And I can, the, the, I associate a lot of sports fandom with merchandise because I'm a huge merchandise fan. I feel like I could still wear an Oakland Raider hat like this one that says Oakland loud and proud with a, with an A's shirt. I can mix and match. But if the A's and Raiders both move, they'd both be Las Vegas and it would be completely a mess. And so that's one reason. And I feel like to add on to that a little bit, when teams move, there's a couple different types of fans. There's people that won't support the team if they move flat out, like, you know, even the Warriors. There's people that won't support a team if they move outside of a certain boundary, like California, like the Bay Area. So that's how the Raiders probably lost it, you know, an amount of fans. And then there's people like me that stuck with them under certain condition. Like I won't buy Las Vegas merch. Um, I, I don't call them Las Vegas. I refuse to call, I, re I refuse to say like Las Vegas Raiders when I'm talking about them usually in context, because that's not who they are to me. I don't accept it. You could be saying I'm living in the past, which I am. I, I'm openly admitted. I am open. I am living in the past with the Raiders. I don't consider them Las Vegas. I consider them an Oakland team that plays in Las Vegas now. That's how I, that what I consider them. You might not agree with me, but I'm not accepting the move. That's how it is. And it's never going to change, um, you know, quite frankly. So that's a reason. And, you know, I just feel like people kind of jump ship. And it's easy to call me out and other Raider fans when you're not a Raider fan anymore. Because if you switch the Niners, you're, done, you're not mad about the Raiders anymore. You have this new team you're a fan of. And, you know, to add on to that, if the A's were to move, it would be a lot easier to switch to San Francisco, like, flat out, than switch for one. That's my biggest pet peeve, switching one. You know, I, you call me a purist, but I think it would be hell to switch to the Niners and not to the Giants. Because... Niner fans, a lot of them probably look down on the A's, and a lot of Giants fans do too. And the Niners and Giants have that huge association with each other, um, being San Francisco, they're friendly. Um, so that 
is an issue. So I thought if I, I wanted to clear that up because I have people coming at me saying, oh, well, you know, you're contradicting yourself because you didn't switch the, the Raiders, but if the A's were to move, you would. It's because they're the association, association with each other. And, you know, I agree that liking the Raiders, it's, it's tough because who, I can blame the city for not completely adequately, how do I don't, you know, kind of the stadium, it, there was problems on both sides. I'm not going to go into detail about it. Oakland had its problems with the new Raiders stadium proposal in Oakland. The Raiders definitely did because they didn't, you know, really want to build here per se, but I guess in their defense, they didn't exactly have the resources to at all times. Um, but that's a whole different rab rabbit hole to get into. Um, but the, the, I will admit, it's not easy being a Raider fan anymore because they're no longer Oakland associated 100%. But in a way, they are because you can still buy merchandise that says Oakland. And to me, that's enough. That's really enough to be an Oakland fan. And to me, it's huge because I love the Raiders, but I hate them at the same time because I, I love the fact that they were Oakland. I have all my memory. I, I can't, you know, also people will say, I'm sidetracking. People will say, oh, why don't you just switch now? You know, I have so many memories as an Oakland Raider fan. And sure, I can't go to games anymore. But I didn't completely go to that many when they were in Oakland because there's only eight a year in the Bay Area. It's not like I'm missing like the A's with the 80 home games a year that they have. But back to it, you know, I think I had so many memories in Oakland that I can't just give it up. I can't jump ship. And with the amount of money, you know, look behind me, I've invested. I, I certainly can't just jump unless the A's were to move. So I just wanted to clear that up because... I have been hearing a lot of things, um, primarily from other Oakland, former Oakland Raider fans. I couldn't exactly tell with some of the people that kind of switched and to them, no offense to you, with all due respect to these people that are calling me out, you, you don't have the right to be mad at the Raiders anymore because you switched, you, you're done with them. I'm not, I'm never going to be done with them as long as the A's are in Oakland because of that association with the town. And you you don't have the right to be mad anymore because you have you're on a new team. If you're a Niner fan now, you know you're living the life. You have a great stadium locally and good for you. But for me, no, I'm gonna forever eternally live with you know this issue of the Raiders being in a different state, which I don't like. But to me, still Oakland, and I don't care. Call, you know, call me crazy, but I'm st I'm still calling them the Oakland Raiders till I die. And so, anyways, guys, wanted to clear that up. But yeah, rhetorically. If you're a Raider fan, rhetorically, I want you to answer, um, actually just answer it right away. If you're a Raider fan that was mad or sour about the move like I am, why are you still a fan? You know, explain why you stuck with them. What was the reasoning? For me, memories, association, the Oakland in general, you know, I could go on, but I want to hear from you guys. Anyways, guys, let me know your thoughts and I'll see you guys later. And yeah, peace out.